pretty much the same. So Japanese Samus is essentially just a buffed version of Samus. She's got like a really strong parry on her grounded up B. Yeah, it's really good. I don't know what else is different. That's the only one I can recall. If there's anything else, it's extremely insignificant. This music. I can't hear the music. Yeah. This is perfect dark. I don't know what this is. Oof. Look at that. Edge guarding young Link. The hitboxes are too big. Patriot, anyway, uh, Samus main has been grinding a lot of online. Yeah. He's been playing a lot. And he's definitely gotten a lot better. Oh, Frey with the Prime Gaming. Yeah, I was saving it just in case I uh, enter the tournament. We'll get you your we'll get you your alert after this. <laughs> I don't have it on this overlay. I did just check. Yeah, that song is Perfect Dark. I had a feeling it sounded very like Goldeneye esque. <laughs> But I knew it wasn't Goldeneye. Yeah. Yeah, there's only the one Goldeneye song. And it's really good. <laughs> Look at that, edgeguarding Young Link again. Yep, so what, what you see him doing uh, essentially is he's just waiting. There's a little period of like maybe a quarter of a second after Young Link's uh, hitbox goes away where he's still kind of floating up in the air. So Patriot, is, as Samus, you know, you're pretty floaty and you can kind of bide your time in the air and just wait for that moment to drift in and back air him when he doesn't have any way to defend himself. The only thing Young Link can really do there is drift. Yeah, in the first edge guard, uh, he didn't actually wait. He just just down aired him right on the head. Right. Yeah, that is another thing you can do. If you're if you're like down air is disjointed enough, it'll it'll work. Yeah, you have to space out really carefully though. It's definitely pretty hard. Anyway, yeah, kind of a still a weird pick to see dogs going Young Link. Not something he'd usually do. I think he's generally more of a, a Falco player, uh, or even just like going Falcon in these tournaments, you know, representing the vanilla characters. Yeah, I was tempted to go Falcon. Um, a couple times just like to get some vanilla characters in there but we got the curve we got kirby and dk 70. he got out of the way to that grab and that might just net him a stop right? all of a sudden patriot is in the lead this is kind of a scary situation to be in uh, playing against samus when she's at this percent you don't want to get too desperate to kill her because she can get a whole lot off of that if you miss space those the attacks or just overcommit, like Dogs is doing with these crazy grab attempts. <laughs> I feel like that one may have been unintentional. I I don't know. Maybe. It's always hard. Like <sighs> the week forder. Sam is now at two hundred and five percent. Still not even close to dying. He needs to get like a meaty hit. Oh, Patriot tried to back Off her the top. Out of the couldn't quite reach with that. I thought he was going to wait again until the end of the duration, but he tried to just trade with it. Last stock game now, but Dogs has a pretty big hill to climb. Uh, especially against like a good Samus like this. It's a mountain. If he... Uh, well, you know, I, I don't want to give Patriot too much credit here. Dogs is a really strong player. He can definitely do it. Um, Oof. <laughs> that back air, though. Not like that. So I'm wondering if we'll see Dogs counterpicking now, switching to a character he maybe plays more often or feels more comfortable with. Yeah, I've never I've never seen Dogs go Young Link in tournament. Especially in a set like this. This is a best of three. So yeah. I don't know if he really wants to play around with fate here too much. He might, you know, just switch off to Falcon. And better player him.
It's okay. Good boy. It's okay, comical. There are a lot of people here that'll that'll pet bird for you. Yeah, the real reason I uh, subbed is so I can farm points faster to catch <laughs> Pokemon more frequently. It's a good call. Taking a while to set up a second game here. I guess they're probably going through the process of panning and counterpicking. Yeah, stages. probably going through stages. It is a good thing, uh, you know, if they did... You can't get, get away with it. If there was a uh, stage striking system in the game... He can't then keep getting away with it! It would probably be a lot more interactive to watch as a viewer, you know, this process of them determining what the stage is. Yeah. Whereas right now they're just kind of idling and we have to deal with it. Can't fast forward K Rex. Yeah, we just have to make stuff up. Dogs could have gone to make a sandwich for all we know. <laughs> we just have to wait for five minutes before the next match. Someone opened the door and dogs ran out. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I'm still curious about the character pick here. Get, oh, there, there's the hand. Yeah, okay. Looks like we're getting a switch. Patriot almost definitely going to stay with Japanese Samus. I don't really know what else he would go. Dog's going Pika. Pika. Definitely not playing around. All business here. He wants to get winner's top eight. Thought he could do it with Young Link, but... And he was able to uh, take away platforms. Look at that, the slope of the stage allowed Pika to run underneath Samus's charge shot. Yeah, man, the glade, I, I, like, this stage isn't as good for Pika because of, the, like, the limited recovery options, but right. being able to run under things in the middle is really nice. If you're playing against, really, any character with a projectile, I think, gets worse on Glacial River. Yeah. And also just like any character with a good defensive move, like a Kirby up tilt at the bottom of a slope, is just going to be even harder to deal yeah, with. Yeah, that was a great conversion from Patriot. I thought he was going to do the after jab two, try and run off down air, but he actually had enough time to do the jump. Dog just wasn't yeah. ready for it. And you know, even though like the, uh, you know, the young link match looked pretty close and you'd think like, well, now dogs is Pika. He's going to do a lot better. Uh, you can't discount just like the matchup knowledge that yep. strong low tier mains have against like some of the best characters like Pika. You know this is a matchup that Patriot has practiced and played a lot more than Young Link. So in some ways it might uh, it might benefit him just having that awareness of what the other character is capable of. Oh, he didn't down here. Yeah. That being said. You know, it doesn't really matter how aware you are of what Pikachu is capable of. It's just what he's capable of that matters, yeah. <laughs> which is a whole lot. So, it, you know, it's no easy task for Samus to be competitive in this matchup. Although I'm, like, I'm kind of surprised to see that Dogs win with this and not like Falcons. He's been playing a ton of Pika. I don't know. Really? I thought I so. Really seen him, I haven't seen him use Pika much at all. I, he pulled it out at Keystone, but he's been practicing Falcon most of the year. Yeah, I feel like he played a lot of Pika online. Maybe I'm just like imagining things from Remix you tournaments. Can't keep getting away with it. So one thing about playing Samus on Glacial River is it. that platform takes up so much space. Like there were a couple times where he could have um, taken advantage of like a shield, like an up B shield break on right. dogs. But the other thing is, you know, it's not going to be as easy to pull off Samus's bread and butter like platform tech Ye cases yep, on yep. such a wide plot. Yeah, it's definitely, I, I think, a bad stage for, for Samus. Yeah, not ideal. That's like that's something you want to ban. Like as a Samus main, you probably want to ban Smashville and Glacial River. Yep, I could see that. Just the stages with the you know fewest options for those those traps. And then if you're fighting against Samus, like something like, like obviously those two stages are great, but go, going to like Dr. Mario is probably pretty good just because like how wide open the middle is. Patriot goes with this uh, Saffron City Dreamland where the middle platform moves up and down. And this is definitely going to be more comfortable for Samus. Uh, even having that top platform go down to the center, it just makes it that much easier to get platform tech chases. <laughs> yeah, this might be the best Samus stage. <laughs> Possible, yeah. 
I think that lowered plat position is better for Samus than the high platform of Dreamland. Oh yeah, I agree. Anyway, yeah, Dog's definitely uh, no joke as a player. He's a serious contender to win this tournament. Especially if uh, other competitors are sticking to their remix cast and Dogs is using, you know, like Kika and Falcon. He's definitely able to give someone like Jaime a run for his money. Nice little conversion there by Patriot. It's a little hard to know what to do here though. Uh, how to kill Pika in this situation. I think he's looking for a Ford Air, just wants to set up like a tech chase on side platform or something. Nice back air covering Pika's ledge jump. You gotta be careful doing uh, too many ledge jumps there against the, someone who's as skilled as Patriot. You know, in a matchup like this. He's seen that ledge jump enough times to know how to cover it. And he just uses the bottom of Samus' foot. Nice nerves from Pika though to scoop up Samus, trying to push him off the stage. It's underneath the Forder, but he didn't capitalize on it. I thought he was gonna, you know, jump out of shield and up her or something. Kinda just let Samus get away. And this is uh this is a best of three sets, so this game yeah. is it. able to close out that ledge hog there. He just he, he committed to grabbing the ledge a little bit too early. So his invincibility just wasn't going to last him long enough. Good falling there though. That's pretty hard for Samus to And Samus, with. Japanese Samus still has the same iframes on aerial up B. Yeah. It's, it's just the grounded one that they get like 10 more. Yeah. Patriot tried like charging a shot there for just a tiny second, but Dogs did not let him have it. He's uh, being pretty aggressive right now. I think that's kind of what you want to do as peak against Samus. You don't really want to play the Samus game too much because you know you're just the better character. You have better frame data, and your win condition is just getting in there and oppressing Samus and not letting her space you out or make you play a slow air game. Because that's kind of what she excels at. Anyway, uh, Dog's looking pretty comfortable in this matchup. It's uh, going to be quite a lot for Patriot to come back here. Especially if he's able to just DI out of the Yeah, players. that up B doesn't really help you a whole lot if they're just DIing out of it. The fourth smash. Three stock win for Dogs. Pika looking a whole lot better than the Youngwig.